Now, there has been a massive story that has broken out in the last couple hours in regards to Gala Games and a lawsuit over a billion dollar hack, which we're going to be going through in this video. If you're a holder of Gala, if you're an investor in Gala, watch this video till the end as we do have some really important info that you need to know about. Before we go any further, the price of Gala at the moment is just shy of 4 cents and also it's gone down by 7% in the last 24 hours. Before we also get into the video, nothing in this video should be treated as financial advice please do your own research and with that out of the way now let's dive straight into this video also subscribe and hit the bell so you can stay up to date in the latest in your favorite cryptocurrencies with that being said boys this was a tweet post by classy games and there's also been a lot of press and articles released which we are going to go through now this Pretty much reads, Gala sues P Network for $28 million. So yes, this isn't a lawsuit, you know, filed against Gala Games. In fact, it's Gala Games who is filing this lawsuit towards P Network for over $28 million. In the event that this succeeds, they will burn all of the proceeds into Gala tokens, which is a big deal. This is what I meant by the fact that this story is a big deal for anyone that is an investor in Gala games. If you actually click on the screenshot here of this article, you can see the GameFi project Gala, that's $28 million lawsuit. The lawsuit stems from a million dollar exploit in November 22 that allegedly took place due to a private key leak. Pretty amateur stuff to be honest. In the event that the suit succeeds, Gala stated that any damages and legal less legal fees will be converted to Gala tokens and burned. Gala is also aware of the damage that P Network auctions cause many other third parties and invites these other injured parties to contact the legal team. Now, this obviously took place in November and now they have filed an official lawsuit which could total up to $28 million. So you can see here. Gala Games files $28 million lawsuit against P Network, Obion Protocol, ORBN. Price pumps again while Bitcoin enters bull territory. This week, the blockchain gaming platform Gala Games filed a $28 million lawsuit against P Network. Obion Protocol pumps again. And Bitcoin, of course, we don't want to really look at that. But of course, this news, ORBN is leading its way to blah, blah, blah. The price of Obion Protocol has just by this and that. We're going to go down to the Gala Games part. Gala Games seeks to create a decentralized gaming ecosystem with Players can truly own the in-game items, characters, and virtual lands represented as a non-fungible token. The Gala token is a native cryptocurrency for Gala Games platform, used for purchasing um, game items, participating in governance, and rewarding players for their contributions for the Gala Games ecosystem. While Gala Games has been making great strides in the blockchain gaming world, the project has recently filed a 20, and by recently, it's literally been a couple hours ago, they filed a $28 million lawsuit against P Network for failing to fix a coding error, which resulted in Gala Games losing over $25 million, which is a massive deal, right? If this wasn't bad enough, Gala Games claims that P Network benefited from the coding error, which, you know, they're, they're there might be you know, some serious foul play from P Network and Gala Games are trying to get to the bottom of it and of course win this lawsuit. It remains to be seen how the legal proceedings between Gala Games and P Network will play out but we just hope for those who lost their Gala funds will be able to get reimbursed as soon as possible. Now this hack was a massive deal, I'm pretty sure I also touched on it on this channel and um, it looks like if Gala Games ends up winning Everything that they do get back from this lawsuit, which from the looks of it is going to be over $25 million, it looks like $28 million actually, is going to be going towards Gala Games and it is going to be burnt, which of course will also help the price, you know, surge in the short term and obviously in the long term that's also some pretty good news it just shows you know the gala is really behind the token and the gala games project which is always some good news there is this other article from Cisium pr newswire which talks about gala use p network on behalf of p gala victims jackson wi on march 20th blah 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 a pioneer in Web3 Entertainment recently filed on a client's and torturous interference with business expectancy lawsuit against P Network, a cross-chain bridge provider. Gala alleged that P Network failed to address a misconfiguration in its code, giving the false appearance of a 1 billion hack. 
um, and unfairly led to a disruption in the market for Gala's own native token, Gala, and required a substantial expenditure by Gala as a result of the disruption. Gala, a nat native EOC20 token on the Ethereum blockchain, has had bridge to the by Binance Smart Chain using a bridge decentralized application constructed and maintained by P Network. Users could deposit the Gala token into the contract and receive the resulting P asset P Gala, basically a token that's been bridged, right? The lawsuit states that P Network admitted they mistakenly leaked a governance key when deploying this P Gala bridge, which such key was later used by an attacker to breach the P Gala contract on the BNB chain. The recovery plan presented and executed by P Network failed to recover the assets and they were subjects of the attack and caused by risks such action presented. Gala asserts that P Network sought to increase the utilization of its platform by issuing P Gala and P Network benefited from its association with Gala Games. Therefore, it owed Gala a duty to care to avoid causing harm to the company or tokens when P Network breached its duty to be neglect. I can't even say the word, neglect Kentley and uh, recklessly causing a security breach, it caused damage to Gala through out of pocket cost of over 25 million USD to address the aftermath of the breach and reputational harm due to the market disruption. Further, the Gala tokens are essential components of Gala's business. P Network was aware that the prospective economic advantage in the value of Gala tokens, as the entire function of P Gala is tied to the utility of Gala tokens itself. It's a bit like you know, having a token and then also having it like an Ethereum and wrapped Ethereum. That's literally what it was, nothing more than that. And uh, it was meant to be utilized as a bridge from the ERC20 network to the Binance Smart Chain. Now, when P Network negligently and recklessly caused security breach and internationally carried out a failed recovery plan that caused further harm, it negatively impacted the market's perception of Gala and the Gala tokens damaged Gala's reputation and caused harm. Um, to its reputation with exchanges, which it did. There was in the short term, it saw a massive dip, and I think anyone that you know was invested in Gala and was looking at the chart at the time, you could tell that it's taken a massive hit. Now Gala is seeking 27, let's just round it up to 28 million dollars from the out-of-pocket costs due to the breach, additional compensation for injuries, punitive damages, and other relief to the court would deem just and equitable. So let's just say. We'll end it there, but yeah, it was a pretty, pretty interesting day today with this news breaking out, and uh, it looks like, in my opinion, there isn't much go, you know, getting away from this. But when it comes to P Network, I do believe it is literally as straight as, as straightforward as P Network making a mistake, and uh, it wasn't just a little mistake; it was a multi-million dollar mistake, right? So yeah, we'll leave it at that. It, in my opinion. It will be, you know, a massive, massive deal if Gala ends up winning, which I think they will. And of course, it's going to be a big deal for us, you know, Gala investors and Gala holders and, you know, people that actually believe in the Gala token, as that's going to be a serious amount of Gala tokens that are going to be burnt from the supply, right? Now, to end it on a better note, I should say, um, in regards to Gala, there's been this tweet posted by Classy Games, who talks about Gala films and a major actor possibly signing. This was a post in the Discord from a Gala Games employee benefactor. This was on March 22nd, so literally two days ago from the time of recording. We signed a major actor to, as of yet, an announced film we are making. It's likely that it will be news in the Hollywood press, so I figured you should have a sense of what is coming. Guys, this is a big deal. You know, these guys are not only building in one sector here um, when it comes to Gala. They are building in multiple sectors, gaming, film, music, you name it. In the entertainment sector, these guys are really going for it. And yeah, guys, that brings us to the end of this video. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, leave a like, subscribe, and hit the bell, boys. I'll see you guys next time. Take care and peace.